Well, early slate selection takes us to Gainesville, where unranked Florida hosting second ranked team in the nation. Auburn has lost 13 straight games inside the Stephen C. O'Connell Center. To shout out to the Icons Basketball Podcast. Last win coming uh, at Florida in 1996. Auburn's a four point favorite. Did the Tigers win and cover today? They have got a, such a good roster from top to bottom. I think Auburn's going to win and cover here. I, I got a lot. I'm picking Auburn in this spot because I have a lot of questions about Florida. Florida easily projects out of the field at the moment. The Gators are unquestionably a letdown. Auburn, this is becoming the stat that you have to almost reference every time you talk about the Tigers. Undefeated in regulation. The two losses happened in overtime this season. They've got so much more talent. Walker Kessler's the National Defensive Player of the Year. Jabari Smith is right there for Freshman of the Year. These are two of the 12 to 13 best players in all of men's college basketball. I'd like to see the Gators actually show a sign of life here, and a win would really make them one of the more intriguing NCAA tournament resume cases in the here. Now, if they can get the win, I don't know if Florida has the offense to do this. I have a lot of questions. I want to see something out of the Gators. The one thing to keep an eye on in this game, though, is if you followed Florida this season, they have largely, not every game, but a lot of the games, they have played to the talent that they're going against. So that's been a good thing in some of the games they've played against really good teams. They've had a lot of games against subpar teams where they've played down. Will Mike White be able to get his guys up for this one? I think it'll be close, but I'm just going to trust the much more talented, much more consistent, much better team. It's been Auburn. Yes, it's on the road. That's an incredible stat. One last thing here, Kenny. I guarantee you Bruce Pearl knows that stat. I talked to Pearl a couple of weeks ago, and he was running down his record against every single team in the SEC, location included. Like, he knew that they had not beaten Old Miss on the road since he had gotten there and et cetera, et cetera. So I know he's aware of that, and it would mean a lot to him in that program if they could finally win at the O-Dome. I think they're going to do it. I agree, uh, but far better basketball team. Uh, you, you mentioned Florida, Florida right now. They, they can't even be on, on a bubble as poorly as they played. Four and four straight up last eight. They're 0-5 ATS, their last five games. It, it's a team going backwards right now. And, and, I, and I do agree with you. I've noticed a couple games this year that you're right. They have stepped up and played well to the competition because these are good athletes. They're just not great athletes like Auburn is. Auburn's amazing. The one, the other scare to this game, Auburn has been so good at home this year. 12-1 and one ATS this year in their home games. They're just an ATM machine when they play at home. Just bet them. They're going to cover and they're going to win big. On the road this year, 6-6 six and six ATS. So they've been 50%. But in this game, I just think they have far better athletes and love, love Walker Kessler, gift wrap for North Carolina. Bruce Pearl couldn't be more happier to get this guy because uh, that inside combination of Jabari Smith and Kessler, wow. Yeah, I don't think there's any better duo inside. So I'll take Auburn. I think they run the score up. Yeah, they are super talented indeed. Walker Kessler, a block machine. I mean, that guy's throwing mini block parties every time he's on the floor. Kenny White, Matt Norland are here with the early slate selections. Let's take a look back at their picks. A uh, lot of good games on the slate. A lot of ranked on ranked games. 22 days away from selection Sunday. Every game down the stretch is super important. Uh, Matt likes Alabama. Kenny likes the over in that one. Both agree on Tennessee taking the points on the road at Arkansas. Split on Michigan State, Illinois. Split on Texas and Texas Tech, but they're on the same page in lockstep with Auburn laying the four at Florida. Do you want a sports network that delivers everything that matters about the game? The highlights, the picks, the instant analysis, no yelling, no fake debates, no politics. Hit the subscribe button and never miss a moment.